Back out to Detzel. There's a wrist shot in. Stopped a loose puck. Here's a knock. Can't a tip. They score. Three goals in the second period powered the Rebels to a 5-4 win over Brandon, a team they're chasing for that final playoff spot. Pretty gutsy win by us. I think we came back and battled back and um, battled there at the end, and they made a push, and we ended up getting the win, and that was huge. Big confidence boost, I think. The winning goal, scored by Chad Robinson, was his third game winner on the year, and he credits an increase in confidence. With uh, carrying the puck and shooting the puck, I don't think I did that enough last year, and this year I think that I've found that back in my game, and uh, that's helped out a lot. No question the win against the Wheaties was big, and big games will likely be the trend for this team as it battles for a playoff spot. Every game for us right now is huge because we're trying to get into a playoff spot, but especially the team that was right ahead of us and we were trying to chase, and we knew that they were going to come out ready to go, and we wanted to come out ready to go. So I think that Brandon win was, it was a huge win for us. But the glow from the Brandon win quickly faded as the team took on the Broncos in swift current and were blanked for nothing. Our attention to detail was, wasn't there. Um, really, I thought that game in swift current was one of our uh, uh, poorer games of the season. Um, so it was uh, certainly disappointing. Um, you know, not really sure uh, why it happened. I guess we turned around against Swift Current and wasn't quite the effort that we were hoping for. I don't think anyone was really expecting that. I don't know if we can really explain why. Sorry, why we why we came out like that, but um, seems to be seem to be struggling against that team this year. So it was tough. Now with a good stretch of games at home to end the month, it's a perfect time to gain ground towards the playoffs, but there needs to be a sense of urgency. In order to do that, we have to have good details, and that's, uh, you know, again, that's what was missing in, in, uh, in Swift Current, just the, the simple details, the, the execution of uh, things we go through every day has to, be, has to be sharp, it has to be there. Jim Claggett, Shaw TV Sports, Red Deer. The pass right back.